Getting ready to uh, put the jug on. Put uh, some 110 handlebars on there. I like them better than the other ones. They're on that 110 over there now. And the pistons in and on and gasket, so I'll do the spring compressor and get the head on. I just painted it, so I'll let it dry a little bit. And uh, that's what I've gotten done so far today. Uh, this is the support member for the Nerf bars that will go across the frame and the old one they put a pipe on the outside well I put mine on the inside so it's cleaner looking and uh, just did a little drilled a hole and filled that with a weld so that locks it in there and clutches back together and it's put together right this time where the last disc is to be in that key there and cylinders in and brakes front brakes are put back on and done and uh, put some 110 handlebars on it they look a lot better than the others I'm gonna need a new get a rebuild kit for that master cylinder because it's still really spongy and I've bled the hell out of it so I know it's done and uh, yeah so that's what I'm working on now so I'm gonna grind that up clean and I'll paint that get these Nerf bars done uh, heads on uh, got a new uh, cam chain guide for the front bam it's on there uh, just waiting on uh, the valves and we'll be ready to go. Got the Nerf bars all fixed up, all tied back up. And uh, got a different brake caliper that was least straight. Um, blah, blah, blah. And uh, yeah. So I think what I'm going to try to do is, um, you can tell the back fenders are newer than the front. And the fronts are in bad shape, but don't want to spend the money so I've uh, cut the stickers off and I'm gonna try that uh, linseed oil uh, paint thinner trick and they say it's 60% paint thinner and then boiled linseed oil whatever so I'll give that a try maybe even try it on the big red uh, those fenders could use it that's for sure so I'll give that a try sticker cool yeah, and put some 110 handlebars on there. Don't know if I addressed that yet. And some sh good old Schwinn bicycle grips. Painted the uh, throttle. Looking all good. And got the uh, headlights to work. And retagged everything. See, uh, yeah, there you go. So you just wipe some paint on there and then wipe the excess off and it'll stay in the recessed parts so yeah so we'll see how this turns out so what's my personal opinion about the linseed oil trick eh. I mean the shine you see is the linseed oil so I still see fade and all that stuff it's just shiny I added more paint thinner to it because I'm like, well, it doesn't feel like it's really eating into the plastic or chemically reacting with it to brighten, you know, and bring the old color back. Uh, I don't know if my paint thinner is bad. Maybe it's too old. I mean, it's paint thinner with mineral spirits. So, don't know what the issue is there, and it's boiled linseed oil. Um, I did use it on the other Hondas, and I mean, really, it just feels like you're putting WD-40 on it. I mean, maybe that's, maybe it's the chemical, you know, combination of WD-40. That's what it feels like. The shine is just the oil. I mean, it looks better, don't get me wrong. But you can still see it's faded and discolored. It's not coming out of it. So I'll wipe it off and blah, 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 and see what it does. I mean, I've let it sit there for 10-some minutes. 
So, don't know if uh, these plastics can be brought back. Maybe it's a Yamaha thing, because every video I've seen, it's a Yamaha they do it to. So. <sighs> yep. Alright, so I gave up on the linseed. You know, it's just a fake shine. That's what I'm seeing. I mean, it... I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I just don't know if it's soaking into the plastic and doing what it's supposed to be doing or if it's just a fake shine. I mean, it kind of worked there a bit, but... So anyway, you can see this area through here, and I've hit this with a hot air gun, and then I've put the linseed oil over it. So... And this area here, in this area, I grabbed my DA and just sanded it a little bit. And, nah, I won't do that. You can tell it's a little more duller in real life. Hard to see on the camera, but... Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to heat gun the whole thing. That'll bring the color back, at least darken it back up. I mean, it ain't going to make it shine. But they're in bad enough shape. I'm, I just don't want to see that crap so much, you know. I don't want pink. So, heat gun it is.